Hey, what's up? It's the longest day of the year, and that's the perfect timing to release our first and most ambitious rock video project ever, and that's K.L. Cocapelli and the Sarong Song. Lots of drama, lots of behind-the-scenes action. We'll, we'll talk about that a little bit later, multiple locations, and, uh, you know, a heated legal battle over Final Cut. But uh, finally, it's all resolved, and now we can check out the final results of K.L. Cocapelli and the Sarong Song. Five, four, three... Network Magic Hour. I'm here with Jeff. Uh, working with Kale. Well, originally, when I set out to book Kale, I, uh, I think it was the guitar that threw me off. But I thought he was like a new wave artist that 
played for Frank Zappa back in the day and married a Playboy centerfold and made a new wave band, which you know was so common place back in that time. Um, I had no idea that he was not a new wave artist, but like a new age crystal gripping sort of dude. But we sort of roll with that anyway. I thought maybe that could be kind of fun, learn something along the way. And, uh, we all have a, a, a fundamental tone. Also, the video gets us up here shooting at Magic Hour with uh, a beautiful crew of quite a few people. We had several cameras on hand. Um, it's not enough to make Kale happy necessarily, but you know. How many cameras you got? Yeah, an artist of his caliber, he has to be very careful about how his image is portrayed. You can't just, you know, point it iPhone at something you call a rock video. You know, it, it would get heated from time to time, but like any creative process, uh, it's got its I'm stresses. Holding the talking and, stick, you know, why are you talking? Then we power through, and that's that's how we make good art for the world and uh, keep the great, great vibes coming. Okay, we don't have enough sage to burn in this joint. Where we we kind of got hung up with the debate about Final Cut is that you know I just said, okay, look, man, Love Network doesn't do fart jokes. You know, it's just you know, it's childish. We don't really. I think it's funny or whatever, and it takes a certain personality to kind of dig that. But and so that was the that was the source of much of our squabble about that. And then then he tried to tell me that well, it, it was not a joke at all. It was just part of his yoga routine. Damn. Hope you guys are feeling the vibe and enjoyed that. We'll be doing lots more of these. So meanwhile, till next time, Namaste. I will check you in San Francisco on Friday. Uh, you know, we have the world's biggest logo being created here for Love Network, and it's going to be coming to the house fairly soon. Meanwhile, it's got a couple stops to make, one of which is going to be San Francisco Bay this Friday, so we can have a look uh, before it gets finally delivered here. So look out for the world's largest Love Network logo. Yeah, it pretty much takes two dudes to play this project. Yeah.